like we all, like we always do at this motherfucking time. I just wanted to take y'all on a little trip with me. Um, check out Kayla, man, King Von's sister. Um, it seems that this lady is the devil. And shit, I want y'all to read that. What that say? She stole his hard drives with his other music. You're trying to destroy his legacy. Everything about King Von belongs to Von's mom. You so rich. Why stealing from your brother? That's sick. Now, let me explain to you why that is all true and why she is stealing from that man and why she scammed that man. Listen here. Now, let's go back to King. I don't want to feel like she set her own brother up. But at the end of the day, like, she acting too guilty. When somebody guilty of some shit like that, the first thing they want to do is get everybody that know them away from them. Everybody he was cool with, they don't want them around them. They become enemies with them. They want to pick fights with them. Let me show you how Kayla did just that. You can say she switched out, but how could she switch out when she's up there saying, fuck old block in this picture? Like, everything about her, everything, like, his ops, that girl right there was trying to cash in. She hung with everybody who didn't like him. Like, check out, hold on. Like, first she went as far as getting the family away from her. Or his girlfriend, she fought down anybody who had a relationship with him. I'm gonna show that too. But look what she said about her own family. And I'm gonna point something out about this here. This is my baby out here in the back too. He she in this video around. with me. Like, you can't even be around certain people because you be acting so fucking weird. Like, I can have her around. She argue. Like, she just a negative, miserable, weird ass person. I have her around. She just arguing with the boys that's around. Like, everybody's, oh, she too can get your sister. Like, you just, you just can't be around. Like, you would never be around me. I would never kick it with you. None of my sisters. I don't fuck with y'all. My little sister's 16. That's the only one I fuck with. And that's the only one I'm going to... See, that's how it be. When you do dirt... You don't want no family around you, especially people who can look in your face and tell and see your movement. You was a broke motherfucker. Now all of a sudden, this man dead. You got mad money. Let his songs come out, Kayla. We know that that girl went online. You stole his masters. Like, it's numerous texts where she just disrespect her family. She ran off the baby mamas. She ran off. She fought. <laughs> Like I said, she going on a rampage with everybody he was he had feelings for. That's his baby mother came in. This her acting a fool, beating up another guest chick that he fucked with, Kayla B. You would think after the brother got killed, she have a little bit of sense to say, let me fall back on this dumb shit. Bitches is dying. But that's Kayla. Y'all ain't most better. I don't really like people. You know I am. Shit stick in my head and it fucks with me. So I'm like, yo. You know, me, her, and all of us. She come around. Listen. Like, you can't even be around certain people because you be acting so fucking weird. Like, I can have her around. She argues. Like, she just a negative. Like I'm saying, back to her. Everybody that didn't like her brother, she fucked with him. Like, listen, me, this is how long she been fucking around. with this I never come around one time when I was on tour with um, 21 Savage and them. The same 21 Savage took her on the shopping spree? The same 21 Savage bought her that Range Rover, right? Hmm. Hmm. On oh, blood. The same 21 Savage who hung with her brother's arch enemy, right? The same 21 Savage over the brother, the dude who wanted her brother dead, right? That same 21 Savage you talking about, right? Right. And you the same one that was saying, fuck O Block, right? I mean, Kayla, come on, man. You got to get your act together. That shit you doing, you taking gifts, you taking all that shit from people who ain't like your brother. Where that leaves you? Will Vaughn approve that you took something from FBG Duck Homeboy? Come on now. There's Kayla B. Beefer with King Von's baby mother. She fought the, I guess, the Cuban dog girl. She beef with his baby mother. Disrespect this kid's mother. When do you have respect for the people that he loved? When do you show respect but 
if you ain't respect him, how you gonna respect anybody that he respect? How, if you ain't have true love for him, how would you have love for anybody that he had love for? Because it's kind of boggling that everybody he didn't fuck with, you fucked with, Kayla. But anyway, while I was doing this video, I started bugging, right? Tell me what you see on my screen right now. I cut the volume down because I don't wanna hear, want you to hear shit this person saying. Just what do you see? What do you see? Like ugly eyes man with a wig, right? But hold on. You know what? I'm going to sway off of Caleb B for a second because I feel like this about Caleb B too. I don't give a fuck. I feel birds of a feather flock together. It ain't here. Not one of them call out the other one. So y'all ain't call out the next one for a reason. Now listen to this voice. What the fuck is this? Y'all talk to me, man. Like, share, subscribe. Tell me what the fuck is this? What you see? What the fuck you see? Okay. One of my subscribers hit me up and it was like, I ain't even finna get into that. But anyway, this shit here fucked my head up when I was saying I was watching this his shit, right? Look what this motherfucker said. I want it to be loud and clear. Did King Von say this shit best? I mean, yo, I'm just throwing together some clips of videos that were sad to me. This was all allegedly sad to me. I'm going from Kayla B to why these chicks, like certain bitches, you'll never probably see her fight like Asian doll. That's a whole man. So how do how you think Kayla B going to fight Asian doll? Listen. <laughs> it's on the end. 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 What the fuck did you see on my screen again? See, I don't... I want to keep the highest level of respect for Vaughn. I want to keep the highest, highest level of respect. So, the, I know this is people that he dated, but the shit ain't right, bro. I remind you. See how she's standing? That's the way Tranny stand to make it look like they got hips. Because if she is standing straight, you would see that she have a flat waist coming straight down. A lady neighbor will not even sit up that fucking high. I mean, it's just me. I'm speculating. Don't get mad at me, Asian dollar, making little videos, dissing me and calling me out. And ah, I'm just, just throwing out what my subs asked me to throw out, man. I mean, you want to believe that these are two girls? Or do you, I want to tell you? It's two fucking men dressed like ladies, man. Shit crazy, Vaughn. I'm disappointed. I'm very, very fucking... You know, I'm going to get a lot of flack off this video. I already know this shit. I'm going to get a lot of fucking flack. But I'm just showing you the truth now. Punk power. Look at these two things. I mean... But the Matrix is real. The Matrix will tell you, ah, these two ladies... Look at the lights going down long ass navel all the way sitting up there. Ladies navels don't sit right there. That motherfucker look like a a Mel Sicily Tyson impersonation. <laughs> Disgusting. King Von, what did you see in this? And then 
Gala Hagen said something about Vaughn said, like when he starts, he walked in the room and somebody was doing some weird shit with some things that looked like ladies. But look, right here, right here. But this is where he was at when God, God like Higgins, I hope you see what I'm saying. This is what he was telling you about right here. If you go on 79th in Miami, you see a bunch of transsexuals look just like them right there. Look just like them. I used to have to go, go through there to go to Hialeah. You just take 79th all the way down to, I think, 27th, make the left. But boom, boom, boom. I used to be like, I used to haul ass. I just want to run the asshole. But, you know, you can't disrespect my because that's their life. I mean, I used to be like, don't fuck with me. Don't be trying to stop my car. Don't be trying to jump in front of a car like dumb shit. If niggas cruising ain't paying no attention, don't pay me no attention. Get ran over. You really believe that that thing right there is a lady? I see why Kayla B probably was so mad at Vaughn. Because she flipped on him. Like, them niggas just saying, that nigga gay, this snap. Okay. Look at that big man in the green holding up some devil horns. Vaughn, I'm disappointed. I want to say what somebody said on one of my one of my subs said about him and Dirk. Said Dirk had a crush on Vaughn. Hmm. Things that make you say, hmm. Look at this man body. That's like my skinny leg ass putting on some high heels and big ass feet. I bet you them shoes probably size 13 big ass feet. And then, now, the reason I did this video, because I really feel like at the end of the day, they tried, okay, things that you think and things that the way that it looks, it's never the way that it seems. I feel like they really tried to make it seem like it was Dirk, it was Dirk, it was Dirk. But in reality, probably wasn't Dirk at all. I mean, not just saying that it wasn't Dirk, but it makes me think. I mean, everybody he had beef with, just like Kayla B, Dirk was with him too. The same way I can show you Kayla. She was with FBG, Dirk, she was with, come on, man. And then... I can't understand. Hold on, I'm gonna show you one more clip. I, I just sit back and try to ask myself, why is Caleb beef with everybody that Vaughn was cool with and friends with everybody he was enemies with? I mean, maybe an OG on here could, could brief me on that because I don't get it. I don't get it. I could show mad different clips and keep going and keep on pussyfooting around this video, but I refuse to. I salute y'all, don't want to shoot y'all, especially not my brother, man, because you came from the brother, from my mother, man. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, that was just a corny-ass line I just made up. But check this out. Thank everybody for watching. Thanks for all my subscribers. Thanks to my subs who definitely be sending me mad info. Um, If there's any kings, hey... Enjoy your crown, man. I don't want it. I'm just doing having fun doing me. So, salute to everybody on. I'm out. Do your homework. Do your knowledge. Get out the matrix. Don't let everything you see on TV fool you.